In this video, we're going to discuss how to share Microsoft Forms with other teachers. As you know, when you create a Microsoft Form, if any students fill out the quiz or activity that you create, all those scores come to you. But if another teacher has made a form that you would like to use, they can share that form with you so that the scores will come to your account instead of the other teacher's account. The first thing you have to do is go to forms.office.com. You can type that in your browser window, or if you're logged into your email, you can click these nine dots in the left-hand corner. Then choose Forms from the list of apps. If you don't see it listed, click on All Apps right here, and they're listed alphabetically. And You'll find Forms here. When you're in your Forms account, choose the form that you'd like to share with another teacher. Now that I've clicked on it, in the top right corner I see the word share. Click on that. The first link at the top is what we normally use to share our forms with our students if we want them to complete a quiz or a classroom activity. We're going to go down where it says share as a template. Use this second link here. It says anyone with the link can duplicate. Click here to copy that link. And when you send this link to another teacher, it's going to make a copy of your form in their account that will no longer be attached to your account. So when they send this link out, to, or when they send this top link <laughs> for, out to their students, then they are going to get the responses when their students do the activity rather than you. When someone uses this link, this is what it's going to look like. It pulls the activity up in student view, but at the top of the screen it says duplicate this form and start to use it as your own. When you click duplicate it, then it takes you into the editing view where you can change the name of the activity, you can change the questions, you can add more questions, anything you want to do to edit this activity you can do now because now a copy of it belongs to you in your account. When your students fill out this activity, you can click on responses and see their answers there. One way that the fourth grade teachers were choosing to share their activities with each other was in Microsoft Teams. We have a PLC group for fourth grade math teachers. In our PLC notebook, we have made a section called Go Math Lesson Forms. We just click the plus down at the bottom to add that section and then we've added pages right here. We've added a page for every chapter and we are putting the link, we're putting this link, the share as a template link, we copy it and we're pasting it under the correct chapter so that when another teacher, if they wanted to use one of these forms instead of having to create it on their own, they could just click on one of these links duplicate it to their account and they'll have their own copy. That way we're just helping each other out and saving each other some work. I hope this is helpful.